All right, guys, I got this really interesting uh, Abus with, with a kind of a neat offer. Uh, check out that keyway. It looks almost C-shaped. Uh, I don't know the model. I did get the box, and I can't quite... I don't know if this is a model Abus V1 with all those zeros and a 43 or what, but this was folded up inside of the envelope. No keys, and the offer is if I get it picked on camera, he will send me the key. So let's give it a shot. Give it a try. All right, I'm going to have to make sure that nothing is pinched. I don't, as I said, I don't have the key for this. So I'm hoping I'm not pinching it in the vise. He looks like he's going to tighten him a little more. Let me find a tensioner here. I don't think these guys are going to work. Let's try this guy. He will work. Yeah, that will work. Um, there's a in right there in the very front, so I don't want to put it up against him too much. This is actually something I made. I This is was a real serrated tensioner. I just heated it up and bent the other end. I use it on real small locks, and it looks like it will work. All right, now I need to pick somewhere over here. I have two picks that I'm going to try. Let's try to rake him. I'll use this little worm. 15 thousandths, obviously, to get up around that nasty, very nasty warding, and another 15 thousandths. If not, I got some 10 thousandths, to, and I might need them to get around that warding. I really don't know. Let's try to tension him and try to do some raking. Try to get a fault set anyway. And like I said, it was from a locksmith. I he in the email that he sent following this he said it was stock. So I'm hoping. Well, let me put it this way: if it's not stock, if it's pinned up in a weird way, then uh, you'll you wouldn't be seeing this video since I stopped doing challenge locks. All right, that's not going to work. Abuses are usually full of security pins, so I'm not going to get discouraged yet. I'll wait a couple minutes. Let's try this guy. I am just going to start trying to put moderate tension and see if I can find a binder. Nice click. That felt like pin six. Pin two. In three, I'm literally forcing these guys, hoping for a false set. That was the warning. Man, even 15,000 is getting hung up in that warning. All right, I'm going to reset this. I think I'm doing something wrong here. Try something different. I'm going to try super heavy tension. I mean, I'm really going to flex this guy. Okay, that's not working. Oh, there was pin three. I mean, I was going to say that wasn't working at all, but I guess it was for pin three. That was pin two. I'll take it. <laughs> All right, we do have a fault set. I did not expect that on Abus with really heavy tension. Again, it might be a, I was going to say it might be a trick pin, but obviously not. Here we go. Why don't you send me those keys? <laughs> anyway, there you go, guys. A, a Abus replaceable core. I really, I want to say it's the V1, but I really don't know. I didn't get the key card with this, nor did I get the keys, so... You know what? Let's go ahead and gut it just to see if there's some weirdness in there. Just for the heck of it. And get all this junk out of the way. Uh, it is picked, obviously. Okay, I need 
these guys. All right, as long as I don't lock it, we'll be able to get in here, I think. Let's see if we can do this without too much damage. All right, so far so good. I'm gonna rotate this a little bit so that the top is not lined up with that crack right there. I don't want the pins to shoot down the side of there. Uh, I will need a follower with a hole in it, not that one. Let's try this guy. He's a little bit small. I don't think I have another one with a hole though, so we're gonna make the best of things here. Let's try it. Let's move this junk out of the way. Let's get that out of there. Let's get a pinning tray in here and see if we can't make this happen. All right, our pins are gonna come out right there on top, which is exactly where we want them. All right, it is a six pinner. I don't see any real weirdness. I see a couple of steel pins there, but I don't see any weirdness. This might very well be, oh, look at there. Isn't that beautiful? Standard. Isn't that weird? Nice cut on that. Standard. Standard. Oh, he won. He was number six. And all these are standard, guys. Nothing weird that I can see here. Completely stock. Uh, there were no anti-drill pins in this, which is kind of surprising in a supposedly right out of the box brand new. I guess they don't put them in all of their locks. Maybe it's a special order item. I really don't know. All right, let's see what we got here. You can see how much smaller that is. So you can see the first one there getting ready to pop out. We got a standard. It's a steel pin. Next one is not steel. Nice spool. I don't know where he flew to. Don't worry about it. We don't know. Oh, he fell back inside of there. Cool. Next one is a... Look at that. Beautiful. I love these guys. If I can get him. There we go. Next one's a spool. There's our standard. There had to be one standard in there. And should be the last one. And he's another one of these little guys. Beautiful. These are tricky. Asa came up with these. All right, completely stock. Let me hope I don't lose any of these pieces because I'm going to need to have it put back together to take advantage of those keys that hopefully arrive soon. Here's what we're looking at, guys. We have only one weird pin downstairs, and that would be this guy. And it, he doesn't appear to be a normal pin. If you look at him closely, he's not pointed on either end. So I don't know what the deal there is, but got a nice little groove in him. Um, the rest of these are all standard, all the key pins. And then upstairs we had two spools and then two of these narrow diameter right here and right here narrow diameter to give you that false set, which is probably, this is probably the guy we were hung up on when I got that deep false set and managed to finally pick him open. Anyway, guys, there you go. Appreciate your time. Stay safe. Stay legal. Send them keys, man. I got something I need to lock up. Thanks, guys.